So we were trying to snake this drain and I could not get my snake to easily feed through. And now I know why, because whoever did this used a two-way clean out tee sideways underground instead of a normal elbow. And then they got it into a fern co into the other side of the PVC pipe here. So yeah, that's super against code. So my snake, I guess, was going down and just going this way and hitting this and getting all hung up and not going the right way. So you got to love what some people do. So what we're going to go ahead and do is we're going to open up this clean out here. That way we can at least relieve the pipe of all the water and the pressure. And I'm going to try to feed my snake down this way to clear the clog. And then they're gonna have to get a plumber out here to fix this and put the proper fittings in because this is no good. So let's see if I can get this thing relieved. This is not an easy one to do. Oh, here we go. Okay. All right, guys. So do not use flushable wipes because this is what happens. Even though they say flushable, they do not break down. They do not dissolve. As soon as one snags in the pipe somewhere, it begins a chain reaction and they keep clogging. And this is what happens. It clogs up four inch schedule 40 PVC. So do not use flushable wipes. All right guys, so as you can see from that video, that was just a small demonstration on what flushable wipes can do. We've been to other jobs where it's been 10 times worse than that. I'm talking like I'm just pulling out flushable wipes after flushable wipes, just all balled up and rolled up on the end of the drain snake. So even though they say flushable wipes on them, they advertise them as flushable, don't flush them because I'm telling you right now, countless times, we go to these houses that are clogged and that's the culprit is these flushable wipes. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to turn the camera around. I have some drain tips here I want to show you. And I also want to show you the package of flushable wipes that I have on hand. All right. So right here, this is just like a typical brand of flushable wipes. You know, you can see right on the package there, they're labeled flushable wipes. Um, like I said, I'm going to keep saying it. These are not flushable. Don't flush them. You're better off just having a small waste basket next to the toilet or in the bathroom and put a bag in there and just throw your wipes in there along with makeup wipes, you know, condoms, Kotex, any of that stuff. Don't put it down the toilet. Don't put it in your drains. It's just going to cause you problems. It's better to just throw it away in a trash can and get rid of it that way. That's the best way to dispose of it. So now what I have lined up here are just a variety of drain tips that we use on our snake. Now our snake is a brass craft 75 foot drain cleaner. I probably will do a video on this drain snake eventually in the future because um, it has served us well. We have used it now for uh, probably going on about like six years, still the same exact snake same exact cable the only thing i've had to do with this snake is i had to replace the end that holds these tips on it because the end actually started to snap off so we went ahead and clipped it off we bought a new end and we welded a new end on it that way you know it wouldn't fall off in a pipe but other than that it's held up and we haven't had to do anything else on it um i mean i do maintenance it you know you want to spray wd-40 all over the cable, uh, oil the cable periodically with a rag and just some motor oil. But other than that, you know, it's, it's held up and it's done its job. So basically you have a variety of cutting tips. That's what these four right here are. You got uh, a couple large ones for, you know, large four inch schedule 40 pipe, as you can see, that kind of takes up 
a lot of the space in the pipe and when that's when that's going through there that cable's being fed and it's turning it's literally just cutting and chopping through whatever's in the way you know this one has some serrated edges as you can see on the end of the tip and this tip right here is just a straight just cutter tip but they they both work equally equally good for four inch schedule 40 now the snake that i have that 75 footer i wouldn't put it in anything smaller than two inch pvc and obviously you're not fitting these in two inch pvc they just they physically don't fit and you would not want to try to jam them in there so typically for the two inch pvc if i'm going down like a roof vent or something like that um i will use a small cutter tip if i think the clog is really really bad but if not then i'll just usually use like a boring tip like this or i'll just use a retrieval uh pigtail tip because i mean the retrieval tip that tears through stuff uh, you know it's mainly for retrieving because when this is turning like around like that in the pipe this can hook onto things to retrieve them and pull them out of the pipe but it also clears clogs and breaks through things and it, it can go around elbows too so you can use these down two inch pipe as well as long as you're feeding it slowly but a lot of times i will just use this boring tip right here because it, it it's that it feeds it through and it does the job typically on on a two inch pipe but four inch and bigger i'll usually use the cutting the bigger cutting tips unless i don't think the clogs too too severe then i'll just use a smaller smaller tip you know um the footage that you saw earlier in this video uh that was just a huge mess so hopefully they got a plumber out there to fix that because that is like definitely against code whoever put that clean out tee in the ground like that is just that's a shame so hopefully they got that fixed because that is probably like one of the number one things causing their problem because the water cannot flow through that but they get that fixed and they stop using flushable wipes and they won't have any more problems so i just wanted to show you guys this and go over that these flushable wipes are not flushable and like i said in the future we'll do a demonstration video and a maintenance video and a how to how to use uh, of our brass craft drain cleaning machine all right so until next time if you enjoyed this video please like comment and subscribe and this is aero general services signing off